Hi guys, I'm Watersea2 from UKLockSpot.co.uk This is an, a lock picking video um, It's a pre-video of some picks that I'm going to send off to the fantastic Capiche on our UK Locksport forum He offers a fantastic polishing service and also makes a lot of homebrew type picks tailor made to your needs that's just roughly showing each of these these are Petersons I literally had to go up polishing a couple of my own each of these not done too bad um, but they could be a lot better hence the reason I'm sending them off to Capiche so he does a very professional job as you can see, the city rake under there, it's got like a black finish on it um, that I don't like too much. So hence the reason I had to go the Peterson gem myself. Also, when picks come off the production line, the autofocus won't zoom into this, but it's the very rough at the back there and also along this edge and that's the worst edge to me to be honest because if you're actually picking upwards and you've got grooves along there they can interfere with the pins so the smoother the finish the better so I'm sending these like I say to Capiche he's going to polish them up for me this is basically part one of the video. We'll combine the two together and show you all these after Capiche. Let's polish them. So I'll show you those three. Like I say in the other video, you will actually see the final polishing vid. So that's part one. Thanks for watching guys, part 2 is coming soon. Well hi guys, this is part 2 of the pick polishing video. It's a service capiche on our UK Locksport forum offers. My 5 Peterson picks returned. The other day and they look absolutely outstanding I was gobsmacked when I literally opened the package I'll try gather them all up I think like I did in my first part of this video just to offer up and show probably gonna get a few fingerprints on here now but look at those they are absolutely outstanding they really are again the auto focus on my camera is absolutely abysmal but I think you will see the difference or you will see the difference from the first part of the video to this I think I also offered up a couple of others that I had a bash at sort of polishing myself and I think one was the Peterson gem I had a little go with it but um, got nowhere fast and I put the city rake just underneath it to show because these were sort of all black before as they come out of the Peterson sort of trade in place or wherever they make the picks and the issue you have when they come off the production line is the fact that they're literally stamped off from a machine so you're left with rivets and all sorts and little dimples but if you check that out I'm still gobsmacked now as to how they look they are so smooth so shiny they are 
outstanding. So he offers a fantastic service there. If you want your picks polishing, contact Capiche and you can do that via email and it's capiche at hotmail.co.uk I think I also offered up, I'm trying to get this right so you can sort of go back to the first part of the video I think it was a, the half diamond in the set um, could have been the city rake I think that was just underneath that and I think it was the snake rake so there you go if you knit back to the first little bit of the video and see the difference between that and this the polished picks outstanding one of my favorite picks in the southard range is this sort of reacher half diamond because it helps you get over pins that you've already set in sort of high security locks etc so it doesn't disturb the pins as so uh, and as you can see there's a bit of a bend just at the back of there so it was bothering me a little bit um, Capiche also makes custom picks tailor made to your needs when I mentioned this he asked if I'd send this also and he made this for me and he's also polished the south and up but if you look at that or compare the two together Capiche's custom pick is identical more or less to the southward and absolutely over the moon with the work he's actually put into these every pick that he actually polishes is done by hand there's no machinery involved or anything like that it's wet and dry sandpaper working from sort of higher grades right down to the lower um, sort of the lower the grade as you get down to the fine of the sandpaper gives the fantastic polishing effect to make them so smooth so there's a lot of time and effort put into these there really is and it's exactly the same with Capiche's custom picks again no power tools involved it's hand filing and also the sandpaper yet again so if you do want a great polishing service on your picks or any custom picks such as this just let him know what you want um, sort of deep hook, short hook, snake rakes, you name it Capiche can do it so again contact him on his email address and it's capiche at hotmail.com UK. so again like I say it wasn't a lock picking video but I always say please keep it legal and thanks for watching